Let's read the soup party. Two friends, a fox and a stork, spent most of their time together. But they did not have the same nature. The fox was a cunning fellow and never shared his things with the stork. One day, the fox and the stork decided to meet over dinner. The fox did invite the stork for dinner to his den but had no intentions of good hosting. He prepared vegetable soup for dinner. He tasted the soup and found it delicious. Being a greedy fellow, he did not want the stork to have any soup. The fox thought of a cunning plan. When the stork came over, the fox served the soup in two flat plates. Come and have the soup, he said to the stork and started slurping and licking the soup with his tongue. The stork could not drink the soup from the plate. It was not possible to drink it from the plate with his long beak. The stork came back hungry. He could understand that the fox had done that purposefully and so he decided to teach the fox a lesson. Then the stork invited the fox for dinner to his place. The stork too prepared a tasty soup. When the fox reached the place, he served the soup in two long jugs with narrow necks. Come and have the soup, the stork said to the fox. The fox could not drink through the narrow neck of the jug. The stork put his long beak inside the jug and happily drank the soup. It was tasty and delicious. The fox returned to his home with an empty stomach. He realized that the stork had paid him back for his cunningness. That day he learned a lesson. Moral of the story is, what we give to others, come back to us.